The project we are doing is a small linear particle accelerator. The idea behind it is that you have these rails set up. Then you put a particle on the first one. Then you electrify it with opposite charges for every rail. Then at this point the particle moves forward because it is repelled from behind and attracted from the front. When it hits the next rail, the only thing controlling the direction that it goes at is its momentum. The process repeats and the particle moves along and accelerates faster and faster. At the end, it hits a target or keeps going or flies off or something. Usually the particle is a subatomic particle and is kept in a very strong vacuum environment and it is magnetically levitated to remove friction. The one we are using uses the concept of electrostatic acceleration and that is what the first particle accelerators used. Nowadays though they use very strong electromagnets. So here is an image of our accelerator rail and this is an image of the particle just a small tiny foil ball. Here is the electrical setup. The power supply is a high volt transformer estimated at 20 kilovolts. Here is the transformer with a capacitor hooked up to build up some power. Yeah. Here is a video of the rails being powered up in the dark. Here is a video of the accelerator actually being fired. This video is from the fourth successful particle accelerator test. The fastest calculated speed of the particle was 90 centimeters per second. It actually went a lot faster, just I could not calculate the speed past 90 centimeters per second without a high-speed camera. Thank you for watching our video on the small linear particle accelerator. Here's a picture of our prototype rail uh, before the really nice rail was built just to test out if the concept would actually work. Thank you for watching.